Welcome back to Tiny Town. As you can see, our Tiny Town world is getting huge. It is getting really, really big. It's only gonna get bigger though, because I've added more stuff. Isn't that right, Knuckles, the little pirate? <laughs> How's it going, Jam? Look at his gun. That is the cutest gun I've ever seen. All right, let's fly on over to Video Game Island. This one was way too easy. Everyone guessed that this was Bomberman, but I think that just means that I did a really good job building him. <laughs> let's go ahead and delete this guy. There we go. I'm gonna keep some of the parts though. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna keep that dot dot right here. This one. This pink thing. Let's just keep that because we're gonna need it for the next character that we're building. So guys, if you have any guesses on who this video game character is, let me know in the comments. All right, I'm going with a white ball here. That's right. We've got white. We've got pink. What am I building? Okay, let's, uh, let's keep going. Let's clone this white one. Make it a bit bigger. He's a bit of a chubby character. I'm actually going to make him smaller, though, because it is a really small character. There we go. Let's just make it like that. Oh, yeah, that looks pretty good. And I, th I think he's just got, like, white arms or something. I can't quite remember. They're really little, these things. They're quite little. I don't want to give too much away because I feel like I'm going to... This one's going to be very easy to guess as well. If I make it too... If I give you too many hints, you just... Everyone will get it. All right. He looks a little bit fat. I can't remember what the body looks like. <laughs> I really can't. Okay, let's just get some balls for feet. There we go. We'll put them down there. And this sort of thing is flying at the moment. I guess that's a bit of a hint as well. These things do sort of fly. Um, let's put that just there like that. I just realized these things look so much like Bomberman. Why do they? Okay, let's... Oh, hang on. Get, throw that away. Okay, let's go with this. Uh, could this, does this make a nose? Yeah, yeah, it sort of does. Okay, I'm not gonna add too much. Not gonna add too much. Might add some eyes. Okay, some little dots. Just some little dots. I think they've only got little eyes. I can't remember. <laughs> looking pretty good. Okay, we'll put that piece there just like that. All right, looking pretty decent. And we've got to give this thing some wings as well, because these things can actually fly. Their wings aren't normally black. But I'm going to add them black anyway, because they're the only wings that I've got, okay? Let's just chuck them in there. That's not bad. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good. Look at this little dude. This is the whole game character. This is it. So if you guys can guess who this is, let me know in the comments. That's... You've got to be able to guess that. It's super easy. <laughs> what do you reckon, Jobbot? What do you reckon, champ? He's like, look at this smug face. He knows what it is. So I remembered that we've got a cave over here. Now, there's some gold and stuff like that grown out of the cave. There's Pikachu for some reason, but I want you guys to come up with an idea for this cave, something that we could build in each video that you guys could also try and guess. So we've got Video Game Island, and then we could have a cave where we build maybe people or characters or something that you guys can guess who it is. So let me know in the comments. All right, let's fly all the way over to the city where we built our Pop-Tart guy here. I didn't get a lot of names for this guy. Most of the comments were like, it's Bomberman <laughs> for the video game, dude. So let me know who we should call this. So we are building a character today that's going to be destroying another character. That's right. A character is actually getting killed. One of the video game, not the video game, one of the food characters. This guy right here is going to be gone. I'm so sorry, Barry Burger. You're about to get smashed, bro. He is getting smashed by our new food creation. So we've got to find uh, something to start building this guy. I am building a whoopie pie. Yep. <laughs> I didn't know what these were until recently. So they are very delicious. They are basically an Oreo in like cookie form. Not really like a small biscuit, which is kind of confusing because I know biscuit means something else to like Americans. It's like more of a cake type thing, but I, I don't know, man. Okay, so I'm looking for something that's shaped a little bit like a black disc. Actually, I just realized we could use shapes. This will make sense. All right, let's go ahead and get one of these. I'm going to make this guy kind of big, given that uh, whoopie pies are quite large. All right, let's sort of go... Oh, how is he going to be? I'm going to put him a bit like this, I think. And he's basically really big, and he is just clobbering the burger guy, okay? Because this guy, I'm already giving him a name. And it's going to be Womping Whoopi. <laughs> yep. That's his name. And it's amazing. All right, let's go like that. That's looking pretty good. There we go. Nice. 
That's perfect. Now we need to use... Maybe we could put this on there. Sort of like this. Add a little bit more of that shape. Okay. Yep. Because whoopie pies are kind of round. I wonder how many of you guys actually don't know what a whoopie pie is. All right. Chuck that on there. Looking good. Now we've got to get the vanilla icing. All right. And I'm just going to run this around here like that. Okay. How's that looking? Oh, not big enough. Oh my God. That looks delicious. Look at this guy. So good. Okay. Now he needs some teeth though, because at the moment he doesn't really have much of a mouth. And he also needs some eyes. At the moment, it doesn't look like much. I'm going to give him some green eyes. I don't use colored eyes very much. Let's just get him looking down like this. Okay. <laughs> awesome. Oh yeah, he's smashing him good. And I think I might use these hands. They're good ones. Let's give this guy some teeth. Maybe like spiky teeth sort of coming up like this. Just like that. Oh, it's kind of hard to make it look like teeth. Okay, that looks a bit better. The hardest part is the fact that the teeth are white. The v icing is white. <laughs> All right, let's get these arms. And these things are just going to be smashing this guy. Let's just make these arms really big. And he's got them sort of together in like a fist formation like that. Yep. All right. Just going to put this arm there like that. Get the arm. Cool. That's good. Put the other arm like this. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Look at this character. Nice. You smashed him real well. <laughs> Bonked the burger right on the head. Okay, let's just sort of smash him like this. Put his eyes out that way. Put his arms up like that, like he's just been hit. The guns have gone flying. This leg is... There we go. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to make that eye just fall off. That eye has just been knocked right off his head. All right, let's get him some feet. These are the feet that I used for my Killy Willy back in the day. It's got nothing to stand on. Okay, let's put the leg just like that. Like he stood sort of on the side of the building. And then this leg is sort of just coming out. This Actually, that's the same leg. Here we go. That's the opposite leg. Let's put that one there like that. <laughs> that is so good. I love the way that this guy is standing. <laughs> Look at him. He looks like he's really struggling to sort of stand on top of this building. But he's doing it. The Whomping Whoopie has smashed Barry Burger right on top of the head. His eye has flown off. Guns have gone everywhere. That is really awesome. I thought Whomping Whoopie was actually quite huge. He's only big in comparison to Barry Burger. If you look at like the weird cake angel. <laughs> or like the bacon snake. What do we call it? Baconda? Yeah, that, that's right. This guy is probably the biggest one that we've actually got. I think Whomping Whoopie isn't even as big as the cupcake guy. Okay, so let's get to building our next area because we're gonna be putting in another Garden of Ban Ban character. And if there's one that you want me to build next, I'm thinking Mr. Grimm. Maybe we should build Mr. Grimm. What do you guys think? But today we're doing Patched Willy. We're doing this guy. He's gonna be the biggest snake dude I've ever, okay, maybe not as big as Baconda. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm looking for some sand. We've got some here, and I wanted to do kind of like sand or an island is taking over the city a little bit. So let's sort of build it like it's coming into the city sort of like this. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's a good look. Okay, spin this over. These things are double-sided, so you can get a bit of variety happening. Let's go like that. Oh, that's nice. I like this. Okay, then I wanted to build kind of like a bit of a cave thing. You know what I mean? Like a cave where we've got Patched Willy coming from. You know, I'm just going to call him Willy from now on. <laughs> All right. Let's kind of put this here. Oh, I'm going to build it out of sand. Maybe if we, we could use this to sort of build some dunes or something like that. Actually, I'm going to use these to build a bit of a hole. I don't know if this is going to work, but maybe we can get a bit of a circular shape happening. Sort of like this. Okay. Yeah, that sort of works. Just go around in a circle. Okay, that thing's looking pretty awesome. I'm gonna add some trees and stuff in just to kind of make it look like it's not just sand everywhere. All right, make the trees a bit of a different size. There we go. Okay, nice. This sand area is looking pretty good. We've got mountains and stuff. We have trees. I'm just gonna move this tree. Let's put that one right there. It's in the way. Let's <laughs> just get out of the way, you stupid tree. Okay, and I'm gonna do a dude sort of surfing down the sand. There we go. I don't really know what a surfing pose looks like. Go like this. There we go. <laughs> that sort of looks like surfing. Or maybe we could do him. He could be doing like a uh, like a body thing. You know how they go down the sand dunes on their stomach? Yeah, that's what he's doing. 
<laughs> there we go. Okay, so we've got to do a bit of a hole here where we've got Willy coming out of. All right, how's that? Oh, that's not too bad. It's a pretty huge hole, though. Let's see if we can make this thing a bit smaller. Okay, looking pretty awesome. Now we need to start getting the pieces we're going to use to build Patched Willy. Okay, so this guy is basically a super big snake. Let's just sort of work out size-wise how he compares to this. So I think he's going to be... Probably about that sort of thickness. There we go. All right, we'll make this purple one the same size. We have to clone these over and over and over again. All right, so let's start just joining these together. All right, green, purple, green, purple, over and over and over again. <laughs> okay, it's all right. This thing isn't going to make me go crazy, probably. Look out, surfer guy, you're about to be crushed, champ. All right, green and purple. Put these on a little bit more of a bend. It's really hard to bend these shapes together. So Patched Willy's only just been released. We don't know yet whether he's actually a good guy or a bad guy. I'm guessing he's probably going to be a good guy just because he looks so nice. And let's have him like he's kind of on his way over to where all the other Ban Ban characters are. Okay, so we don't need these anymore. Let's get rid of them. Okay, so now we need to build his head, and this is going to be the hardest part yet. So I'm going to try and use some of these hoopy shapes and sort of just go like this a bit. Maybe go like that just to get a bit of a head shape happening. Okay, that's not looking too bad. Now let's see if we can put that there. Oh yeah, this dude is looking good. All right, I'm actually going to give him some eyes. So he's just got like black eyes just on the side of his head like this. Oh, I just ripped his mouth off. <laughs> don't do that oh yeah look at this guy he looks so good all right we got to put some little spikes all over him he's got these all over his body all right just one going all the way down on each patch okay how's those spikes look yeah they look really good and he's also got eyes on his body <laughs> yep all right let's get some eyes going on here just like this Oh, yeah, they look cool. Put them on the other side as well. Kind of reminds me of Train Eater a little bit. Okay, there it is. We've got our patched Willy. What do you guys reckon? Should I put eyeballs all the way down his body? I think I will. I'm just gonna... I think it will just look better. Looks a little bit bare down here. Okay, yeah, that definitely looks better. Want you guys to go ahead and rate this guy out of 100. Let me know in the comments. I think this is definitely one of the better ones that I've built in a while. But thank you very much for watching this video. I'll catch you guys next time.